Hey everybody! Hey internet! Hello world! Hi, this is Kachi. And Taylor. <laughs> um, and today I am playing a little bit of L.A. Noir in the background, a game I haven't played in a long time, but it was just like on my list and I was like, hey, that looks like fun! Um, siren. Siren? Siren. Siren. I guess, I don't know, is my siren on? I don't think your siren's on. Anyway, what we're going to be doing today is um, a little while ago I posted on Facebook and other so social media sites for questions. Um, maybe questions you might want to know about me. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Um, press, oh, hey! Press X to ask your partner for directions. Come on, you have to go to the crime <laughs> scene. And then I have to, like, do detective work. Yeah, you have to do your job. I am Kate Beckett. Yes, sir. No, you're not. I'm a male Kate Beckett. I am like Ryan and Esposito. I will take Ryan and Esposito. They are. I love like Ryan BA. and Esposito. Who are these guys? Um, you're beat cop, actually. Oh, I am a beat cop. That's you're right. You're beat cop. These are detectives. I want to become a detective. You want to punch those guys and steal their fedoras. In my heart of hearts, I want to wear that fedora. I want to be you, man with chubby cheeks. I do look a little like Ryan, actually. Assuming that's me. Anyway, we've got some questions lined up from the internet, from your lovely faces, about things you might want to know about me because I am egotistical and narcissistic and self-obsessed and things like that. So he is. <laughs> I have my wonderful, beautiful, intelligent, amazing, brave, daring wife with me who is going to be reading them for me. I like that you, you specifically included brave and daring as though I'm going to be expected to do something that might possibly endanger my life. There's a stunt at the end of this. Oh, is there? Yeah, and you're expected to do it yourself. You have to dive out a window. There'll be sparklers. There'll be a dog. It's crazy. I have a dog. A different dog. He's different not a part dog. of it. Yeah. I didn't want to, I didn't want to risk injuring Echo. Watson? No, there's not Watson. He promised me another dog. I didn't promise shit. Yeah, so y'all have to watch lots of videos so that someday he'll get me another dog. So that I can have my two dogs. I'll tell you what. If I get... If I get above a thousand views of this video... Oh, you're so screwed. <laughs> I don't think you understand the power of Facebook. 5,000 views. No, you already said it nope. at a thousand. Nope, 5,000. Nope, that's it. 5,000. Above a thousand views on this video and I get a new dog. 5,000 views of this video I and you get a new dog. I you getting a brother. All right, so you want to uh, kick into it? Yeah, sure. Okay, so the first question I um, is, uh, what made you want to start doing YouTube videos? Um, do you want the truth, <laughs> or do you want the like? I mean, I've, let's start with the truth, and then we'll we'll give them the answer they they're supposed to want to hear. Okay. And then we'll pick which one sounds better and edit it thusly. The truth is, you shit at this detective thing. I am. Way. Yeah, I'm absolute crap. Your at Your partner's this. doing everything. Yeah work for me dude go do it come on yeah come on um the truth is i wanted to do youtube videos because um i'm actually a huge fan of a couple different youtube channels but one in particular is rooster teeth and they do let's plays and videos like that that i find really really fun and really enjoyable and um ever since i kind of watched them i was always like i kind of want to do this this is something i want to do with my life and it was a big big dream of mine to be employed by them and go work for them and play video games for them and then kind of one day I was sitting there thinking about it and I'm like well I can kind of do this myself really um so hey I found a bottle <laughs> way to you know shadow puppets look it's a bird if that was important you've already screwed the pooch because your fingerprints are all over it's no it's bad. like it's like no it's old timey detective work it's fine it's they gloves back then too no no it's fine see like look look this is professional cop work right here look at that wrist control <laughs> okay throw the bottle at your partner's head I, or not no i'm gonna put it right back down where it was um well i already got the clue stop stop <laughs> stop and so yeah i just decided hey i can do this youtube stuff too um, I spent a tax return on a new computer, which would help me play games at really high quality, and my wife got pretty mad at me. What, what? <laughs> hey, now. Okay, you have to set that up as this was right before our wedding. Yeah. And I was cutting costs on our wedding in order to make sure that we could afford everything, including the fact that I have a used wedding dress, I did my own bouquet, you know, all that stuff. And I spent a lot of money on a purchase mm -hmm. that maybe we could have talked about and... Yeah, planned a little should. more for yeah. and that's my fault mm -hmm. 
<laughs> but yeah, um, we did Lego Harry yeah. Potter, which was the first series that yeah, came we, out. We did that. There's a question about that on here later, so don't talk too much about that because that's right. There somebody, is somebody. Somebody wants to know more about Lego Harry Potter. Oh, clue! <laughs> it's really? a clue. It took you that long to find the fucking brain <laughs> splattered all over the wall. Let's put it in our notebook, and we'll go to our thinking chair later and consider what this means. It's a Blue's Clues reference. You've never seen Blue's Clues. I have not seen Blue's Clues. I did not um, watch Blue's Clues as a child. Apparently, I'm deprived. <laughs> okay, so yeah. Um, yeah, see, add it to my notebook. Look at that. Open my notebook. Clues. Bloodstain. Blood stain. Nothing about the bloodstain, just bloodstain. There was a bloodstain. There will be bloodstain. All right, what's this way? Uh, inspect an object. The window... Has a gun on it. Look at that. Ralph, something on the rooftop. How are you gonna get up there? Uh, the parkour. Reflection in the window. Looks like it might be our weapon. I'm gonna see if I can parkour, find a way up there. Parkour. I'm gonna see if I can find a way up there. Hardcore parkour. Okay, so um, are you ready for the next question? I am. Okay, so this you actually kind of already answered this a little bit of who or what inspired you to make YouTube channel. I I should mention that yeah these are pulled from a lot of different sources so some may overlap a bit. Yeah, oh that's fine. Um, but yeah. Yeah, you already kind of talked about Rooster Teeth. Rooster and... Teeth was my big inspiration. Oh, um, you're shimming like the kid in the gnome mobile. Gnome mobile. Gnome mobile. Gnome mobile. Riding along in the gnome mobile. Oh, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> so just like a light going on in that building. Yeah. Huh. Um, I think it's a party and you're not invited. Can I get this board? Can I put this board and like walk over that way? I or? don't know. And can you? Can you jump? I don't know. How, you doing, Cole? how are you doing, Cole? Found it yet? Shut up! Yeah, I found it, you dumbass. I just have to figure out how to get the fuck over there. I think you have to climb up over on that side and then go over. Shimmy sham? Yeah, no, you have to go back up on another like pipe or some that. shit. See, look, there's another pipe. You have to climb the other pipe. Oh, and I'm running. No, can't do it. Really? It won't let you climb that pipe? No, nope. get out of my way, box. Resisting probably police work. Probably ne dope needles around here as well. Dope. Alright, so how do you get down? Uh, I just want to get the gun. you got to get on that building. I think you have to get in. How do you get huh. down? Get I don't down. know. Okay. Oh. Oh, wait. There's a gun here as well. How convenient. Man. Smith and Wesson. Hey, Smith and Wesson. One, eight, nine, three. Yeah. Yep. Okay, well, fabulous. It's full Two of bullets. Fired. Two rounds have been fired. Oh, uh, okay. Drain, our shooter voices it up here. Interesting guy. Full of bullets. See how they have the little... Yeah, the holes. Yeah, that's, that's how you can tell that a round has been fired. Okay. Yeah. Bang, bang. Yeah, bang, bang, because, bang. because on a on a on a six shot like that, you have to when you want to reload, you have to open it up, dump them all out, and then reload. All yeah, the they don't like eject. Yeah, it's not like a shotgun. Okay, so I'm not trying to get the gun. I just yeah. came up here to look for shit. Okay, that's cool. Let's shimmy sham back down. Oh. We have the gun, Cole. Let's take it. We could get a commendation for this, commendation. apparently. Show some initiative, right? Um, Rooster Teeth was my big inspiration. Um, Game Grumps is another one. I know I'm mentioning like huge name channels, but honestly, that's what I watched, and that's kind of what got me interested. Um, Peanut Butter Gamer is another person who does it, and then actually, um, lately I've been working with and kind of talking to a lot of other people doing things, um, like some people I do collaborations with, and that really ins inspires me to keep going because I see the success that they're having with this and I want to I want to kind of be right behind them as far as subscribers and minutes watched and things like that so yeah okay. alright so next question what games are you interested in you playing sure and this? posting really um, I know some people really like the horror genre that seems to be kind of a big thing lately people watching and playing horror games um, I'm not much of a horror game person. I'm kind of a pansy, for lack of a better word. But um, in that regard, I like things like uh, platformers are okay. I don't mind platformers. I just have to break in with that my husband is very much a pansy. 
Yeah, she loves the yeah, like, okay, horror so genre. Yeah, okay, so he can't do horror movies. He can't do, like, like, uh, like creepy pasta. No. Like, he was terrified of Slenderman. Te- I'm still a little He's terrified still a little of Slenderman. little terrified of Slenderman. So, In case you want to know that. Yeah, it's it's kind of funny actually. I love I I love horror movies and horror games and and all of that stuff. I'm huge huge fan of scary movies and that whole genre. I like like comedy games and things like that. Yeah. Um, I guess we're going to the gun store. Gun store. Boom! I can do that via my notebook. <laughs> wow, it's like pre GPS. Uh... I'm a cop. I get to drive like crazy. Uh... But um. Yeah, so not so much horror games, but I do like, um, I don't know, what do I like? Oh, you like, um... Puzzle I mean, games are fun. Puzzle games, Minecraft. Oh, yeah. Um, Sandbox games are just really fun. Yeah, you, you're more like RPG. You would like some of those, like, smaller... Oh, good job, man. Nothing here is moving along, citizen. Everything's fine. Everything's good. Um, you like some of those like smaller games that haven't like. Oh, his um, engine's on fire. Are you doing what? Um, starve together or yeah, don't starve? Don't starve. Um, whether uh, it's together did... or alone, that's fun. What was that one where you were like in the middle of nowhere and it was winter and you were just by yourself and we had to keep checking cars for bodies? It's oh, not... um, I haven't actually posted anything on that. That is the Long Dark, I believe that's yeah, called. Yeah, that one. That one was kind of fun. That is really fun. Um, those survival kind of games yeah, are really really fun. Yeah, survival games are great. I really like that. Um, I'm not a huge first-person shooter person. If like if I can do third-person, I'd much rather do third-person. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But you know, I'll I do some really FPSs. Play a whole lot of first-person shooters. Not a whole lot. The Long Dark is a first-person, but it's not a shooter necessarily. It's kind yeah. of a survival thing. If, for anyone who doesn't know, it's like um, I think the closest to first-person shooter you've played is Bioshock. Yeah, Bioshock. I love Bioshock. Bioshock it's hard not to love Bioshock. Um, I think you can go in the store now. I can go in the store, you're right. I think you just have to knock. I don't even think I have to knock. I think I can just walk in. I'm not a vampire. I don't have to be invited. Not a vampire, not a parkour kid. Not a parkour kid. You don't have to be in- Parkour kids have to be invited. They're like vampires. Mm-hmm. But, um... Yeah, so... I don't know. I don't, I don't have a genre to myself. RPGs are fun. Puzzle games are fun. Sandbox games are fun. Um... Okay. Yeah, so there. So there. Ha, huh. deal with it. Let's see. Okay, next next question. Um, what is the software and programs that you use to play? Okay. Um, so I don't know if... Somebody's got a little fan out there who wants to be just like you. You see it on there? So I have not yet played any console games on my channel. Um... Everything I've done is through a PC. Now, that might change because I do have a really awesome friend who uh, just gifted me an Elgato, which is, uh, for people who don't know, an Elgato is just a, it's a capture card that you plug in. One part of it goes to your console, so like a 360 or an Xbox One or whatever. Um, and then the other end goes into your computer. So as you're playing it, the computer is actually recording it. So I might do that in the future, but for now, what I just do is I play games on PC, mostly Steam, sometimes not, um, and I have a couple different bits of software to help me out with this. So what I use most often is actually a program called DXTory, and it's a piece of uh, filming software that records the game as you play it. So it kind of cuts down on processing power just a little bit. And then that also records audio as well, set as destination so I don't have to sync up my audio and my visuals like I would if I was using a capture card software because the capture card doesn't record your microphone you have to do a different program like audacity to do that now that being said sometimes there's games that DX Tori doesn't actually capture and in instances like that what I have to do is I have to use a program called um, open broadcasting software or OBS um, and then in that case I have to sync up my audio with the game which is really easy you just kind of make some kind of visual cue as you're talking which is what film does um so i do that those output a raw file and those raw files are usually pretty big so i then go put it into uh, adobe audition or sorry not audition auditions for audio adobe premiere is what does video edit it up a bunch 
and then chop it up into segments, throw on my open and close slates, which I use uh, Premiere and some After Effects stuff for, and then render it with Adobe and put it on YouTube. So pretty simple, straight, easy process. You are the drunkest cop on the street tonight. Yeah. You are like all over the fucking place. How okay. fast have you been drinking, civilian? Yeah, you can oh, okay. fucking cuss sorry. all you fucking want. I'm sorry. I wasn't sure. I no, it's mean, okay. You have, you have siblings now who might watch you. I, I, purposefully, I purposefully try not to tell them what my channel is. Yeah, that's true. Don't, don't tell just them. Just so, the yeah. Is. Just so they don't watch me and because I like cussing. I don't... I'm just going to park here. Hey. Hey. Do I have a gun? I like that your I don't body have a gun. pushed that car off the street. Like, I don't have a gun. You walked right. into it. Yeah, right? I am be a baller. Okay, so gold doors let you open them. I don't think you can open that door. I can't. Where's the flag? Did I park too soon? Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I guess I did. Oh, well, okay. Moxley's. Moxley's. Schroeder. <clears throat> okay, so have you fully answered that last question? Uh, yeah, I think that's... Okay. Um, do you happen to have any games that you will never play? Never play is in all caps. Um, so I'm Never assuming that play. the person asking has some kind of moral issue with certain games and wants to know if we feel the same way about things. <laughs> um, I say I say I won't play horror games. I don't know if that's necessarily true. That's that's also that's there's another question about horror games on the list. So okay, well, Sherwood, what's, Schroeder, Arwood, and T. Apartment two. Look, he's the only one with like a like a, uh, a brownish. Name tag. He's about been there the longest. I don't know. Maybe. maybe or maybe they just don't like him. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe he like pees on things. Who knows? Like his name tag. Yeah. Every morning pees, he comes down. Yeah, he comes down and pees on his name tag. It's <laughs> weird, and it's like, you know, they're not quite sure if he's like stupid or if he's like that level of genius. You know, like the aviator guy, like Leo DiCaprio, when he's yeah, peeing yeah. in the jars at the end there. Yeah. But like the people in the main office are like, oh, that Schroeder. Yeah. Or whatever his name is. Um So what's the other horror question? I'll answer them both at once. No, no okay, so the horror questions are further down. So, so someone asked, like, do you happen to have any games that you will never play? But someone else asked, do you think you'll do more scary games? Um, yeah, probably. I mean, people like scary games, and I know I have people around me that like playing scary you're games five with me. At I... Uh, oh, um, oh, fisty cuffs. It's it's going down. It's okay. Ow! You punched an officer, dude. Yeah, this is LAPD in the forties, okay. though. So. Block. Oh, okay. Um. Just keep pressing. Just keep pressing A and beat the crap. Wow, he already beat up your partner. Yeah, he. I didn't one even know hit when punched that him. happened. I wasn't paying attention. Counter. Grapple. Grapple. Oh. Oh wow. Oh, there goes the chair. No, you stay down. Oh, was that a dick punch? No, it's like a solar plexus dick right. punch. Yeah, I'm a tough cough. Uh, <laughs> you're the nice, yeah, you're the good cop. I'm not, a tough cough. Not good cough, but like, you're like the BA cop. Bad I am. Ass. Buy it, ass. Um, an Investigation apple. music plays. Apple. Mm, I don't think so. It's important. Oh, put it down and do your job, damn it. Um, so I shouldn't say I'll never play horror games because just because I am scared of them and a pansy doesn't mean I won't. Also, there's a bottle of beer that's the same as the bottle of beer that you found in the um, alleyway. I don't think that matters in this world, but it's uh, something I noticed. These dates? Dates or times? Schrodinger's notebook. Series of numbers. Is that Schrodinger? No, Schroeder. it's not. I know. Schrodinger's the guy with the cat. Yeah. And not cat. The cat, not cat. I have good news and bad news. Oh, news. well, skip that. Don't care what you have to say, partner. <laughs> I'm going to be a detective, and you're not. <laughs> oh, cutscene. Anyways. Um, so games I won't play. Yeah, horror games mostly. Um, Call of Duty. I don't think I'll ever play, like, Call of Duty. Those, like, FPS shooters that are just, like, shooters, and that's it. That's all you do. Not a huge fan of them. Um... Except for some, like Halo's good. Halo's fun. It was really fun. I love Halo. Um, I haven't played in years, but I love Halo. I mean, that's kind of it. Mainly because I suck one v one at first person shooters, and I don't like playing against other people. And Halo's fun because it's got a nice, good storyline. I'm sure Call of Duty does too. I've just never actually played one. Um, Call of 
Call of Duty is more fun to just shoot things. I mean, it does have like a purpose in the storyline and everything, but it's like secondary to the shooting of all things. I shouldn't say I don't like first-person shooters, because I really like Last of Us. It's probably my favorite game right now, and that's a first-person. No, it's an over-the-shoulder shooter. I'm, nope. Yeah, it's not quite a first-person shooter. It is an over-the-shoulder shooter. So, yeah, whatever. It's more an adventure game, yeah. Games, Good games won't you play? Um, I don't know. Games like um. <sighs> I'm not big on games that are like violent for the sake of violence. Um, I don't know, like bully and um, and those sort of games where it's just like the violence is the main attraction of them. I suppose so. Um, I definitely need like something that I have to do in the game. And I'm I'm not huge on first person shooters unless I need like stress relief. Um, that used to kind of be my thing in high school is I'd go over to my friend's house and she had a big T like big T V and this was like back in like the early two thousands, so by big T V I mean like average sized T V now. Yeah. But we would play like Halo and Call of Duty. It's like early Halo and Call of Duty and stuff to like get and like be angry. Maybe oh yeah. Halo Rockets. Oof. That's fun. Teddy Grahams and and frosting and play Halo. Like that was that was like <laughs> girls' night for me in high school. Oh, I married the right person. Uh so yeah, I mean um I'm trying to think, like, specifically. I don't really like racing uh, games. Oh, I like racing games. I like racing I like, in games. Like, I'll race game, I'll race cars in, like, GTA. I don't like car racing games. I like, um, I like you know, like, Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong's and, awesome. Um, Mario Kart. Mario Kart. And then, like, Pod Racer. Like, Pod Racer was Pod fun. Racer's great. I don't like classic just car racing Can you tell how old we are? No, yeah, I'm, we're <laughs> seriously dating ourselves right here. I'm looking at our N64 games like all lined up and being like, ah, that sort of shit. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm trying to think. There's not a whole lot of like... Got to terrify them a little bit. Um, Overly complicated games. Um, I can't do things like... Oh. I don't know, like... Oh, oh, um, I would like World of Warcraft and League of Legends and that sort of stuff. Oh, Games yeah, that require yeah, 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 yeah. a significant time and potentially, like, monetary sync. I can't do those because I just, I don't have the temper. It's like, my idea of, like, a perfect game is, like, a game I can sit down and if I play it over, like, a weekend or a week, I'd finish it. And it'd be done. And it's like, which is not to say that I wouldn't, like, come back and play it again. But, like, the fact is, this is like, you know, it's something, like, I like a definitive end to my game. Oh, absolutely. I love storylines in games. Yeah. Um, um, so, like, you know, I have a lot of friends who play, you know, who play the, art, the like, intense, like, online RPGs, like, you know, World of Warcraft, League of Legends, Brad and his like, Yeah, Legends. Brad, Brad being a Shout good one. Bradley. Um, Bradley. Bradley. Big, big League of Legends player, and yeah. I'm not a huge, I, I, you'll never see me play or stream anything like that. I mean, I can definitely see the attraction of it. And I think the closest I've ever come is, like, Skyrim. But even Skyrim was a little much for me, because there's just... I mean, Skyrim um, has a story, though. Yeah, Skyline has a story. Skyrim has a storyline, and there's, like, there's a, there's a definitive end. Like, you can beat Skyrim. Yeah, you um, can't beat But it, it comes awfully close, because it is so big. It's so big. Okay, but that being said, I also really enjoy games <laughs> like, um, no. Oh! Yeah, you shoot that guy. He ran in front of me. I, just, I, I turned slowly and casually. Um, I won't play League of Legends, but I will play things like StarCraft and um, Age yeah, of Empires. Those top-down strategy games, Civilization, I'm a really big fan of. Was, was StarCraft, uh, no, what was it? Um, Neverwinter Nights, which one was that? Was, um... Neverwinter Nights? Never played Neverwinter Nights. No, it's, it's like, um, it's not StarCraft. I'm going to have to look it up. I don't remember what the game actually is. It's, it's like not StarCraft. It's, um... Oh, I don't remember. Someone will tell us. Ah, uh, yeah. Leave a comment on what game you think we're talking about. Yeah, Neverwinter Nights. Hang on. Wait. Okay, here it is. Wikipedia. Blah, blah, blah. The magic of, of smartphones. Hmm. I remember Neverwinter Nights, but I don't think it's what you think it is. Maybe, maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Um, yeah, no, this is not what I was thinking of. Huh. I, think, I must be thinking of something else. I'm doing great here, just so you know. Sure. No, don't move. I just found out where you were. I don't know. I, now, I'm, now my brain is like completely fried. Like that, I played that one in high school because my brother had it. It's like one where you could like build your own character and then there was the whole like RPG thing. And it was more Dungeons and Dragons. 
than um, third person. Black and white? Maybe? I don't remember. It's been so long. I say that's been like 10 years. <laughs> yeah. So long. It's been so long. We got them all? It's been so long. I think we got yeah, but as, as far as games that I here. won't play, is definitely games that require a lot of money or time sink. Oh, yeah. Anything you have to pay for, uh, like monthly subscription, like, don't. I pay for my games. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I promise. I, play, I, I pay for my games. But um, no, monthly subscription things, like WoW is a big example. I will not touch WoW. Or um or any of those Facebook games. Yeah, so Facebook games. Pay to play. Stop inviting me. I'm not going to play Farm Bitch 25 or whatever it is you want me to play. Corey. Farm Bitch 25. I'm talking to you, you fucker. This kind of opportunity. Um, no, it's like every fucking week. Corey is like, you should play this. You should play this. I'm just like, go fuck yourself, Corey. You just want the next carrot level or some shit. Well, no, and it's like these like Facebook and mobile games have infected like mainstream gaming now, where pay to play is an actual legitimate thing for a console game. That's ridiculous, and that upsets me. Mm-hmm. You don't seem the Sergeant York type to me. I think before we get onto a rant about pay-to-play and that sort of thing, that's going to cause people to blow up our comment section. They call it the Custer Syndrome.